Hello everybody, today I show you how to create pagination Laravel 5.5 When we, before we use Laravel 5.5 with, with pagination, you can go to cedar.com and you can to see the how to use the pagination in Laravel 5.5 you can click the pagination and this is we use the, the, the best pagination this is the introduction on Laravel support with the bootstrap pagination or you can customize by yourself this is the basic usage paginating query be the result yes in the pagination you can use the pagination you can see query the reader for example if you want to use the nice and previous boot to button you can use the simple pagination yes this is the nice and previous link in pagination with you right now i want to show you how to use the pagination yes you can use the pagination like this for example if as a, when we use the db you can is uh, import the Illuminate support slash PascalDB. Yes, then I go to the controller resource. Yes, so I change the get to paginate. Yes, this is the number that you want to sell from the database. Uh, refer to the record, for example, in when we import the file mean that we use the pagination lost record from the web file as a per time when you click okay i go to the student resource yes take list so you can see it like this so i want to add the render below for example Okay. And right now I run and you can see the pagination once yes. So right now I want to put yes, I want to I want to include the bootstrap for example you can include the bootstrap when we link you can just like this for example I go to the browsers and run again and you can see the pagination like this because the lot of web pagination is part of bootstrap okay. and now you can go to the for example it's I use 10 mean that the page one because the records there isn't the record is a uh, no 10 records in the database so you can count for example yes you can put a file number okay right now I go to the in touch and put it here and I use the bootstrap class for example you can just like this hey right now I gonna again yes you can see it like this so I want to change the DD button Okay, and I want to use the pagination. Okay, you can go to the just the pagination simple. Okay, you can copy here. Yes, I go to the resource controller and paste here. Okay, right now I press. You can see the nice and previous. Okay, as you can see the more 
Regeneration ni Lau Kuan Riza that I saw you are day. Regeneration. Well, regeneration with the wear clause. Manually creating paginator. Okay. Displaying pagination result, you can see it like this. I show you already. If you want to use the range, for example, if you want to range the number of users, yes, for example, I go to the pagination in touch. Good. And you can just key away. Okay, it's very nice. Okay, press. You can see one, two, three, four, five, and we nudge. But when I want to one two, but I don't so like this. So you can go to see the pagination. Yes, you can see the result first item counts last page. Okay. Okay, you can get the uh, instant measure, for example, counts, run page, first item, have some page, last page, yes, not page, you are, if you want to use, for example, I go to the page, yeah, you can see the number when I niche, mean that over and over again, one, two, three, and if I want to niche, over and over again, one, two, three. But I don't show like that. I want to show the array number. Okay, you can go to the choice. Yes, the class student first item. Okay, first item, first item, you can just like this. So right now I refresh. Yes, you can see the six when okay, and the previous one, two, three, four, five, six when yes. Right now, record in the database so when records. Yes, if you want to convert to the JSON, you can use it like this. For example, I want to convert return app JSON. For example. Reach one student. Okay. I refresh. You can see the current page. Yes, JSON. Yes, run and refresh again. You can see the current page. Can see the collection item. Yes, you can see more by yourself. For example, if you want to customize by yourself, you can use it like this. For example, I go to the page.
as nice and previous and now you can inspect and then you can copy the class for example class pagination and can be at by yourself in time if you want to customize by yourself okay yes. yes if you want to customize okay so when I copy here this is the class my pagination okay so when I press okay yes. And I, I change to the page names. Yes, this is the customer as uh, with the class pagination. Okay. Okay, so right now I show you just this time, so I want to the just finish this tutorial. Thank you very much for your watching my video how to create pagination Laravel 5.5. And especially, don't forget to share, subscribe, like, and comment on my video. Thank you. Say goodbye.